This is the Blaring Out with Eric Blair show. And today we're at the 10th annual Tony Hawk Foundation Stand Up for Skate Parks event. What do you love about the Tony Hawk Foundation? Uh, I love the way that um, it not only motivates individuals, but by the way this, the parks that, that get built uh, inspire and bring together communities and a sense of community. What was the thing in your life that put you on the right track? And unfortunately, there's kind of only two tracks. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. And, and uh, what always kept me on the, on the right track is that voice that parents instill in their kids at a very early age that is consistent with, at least when you're not on the right track, knowing that there is a right track. So I'd have to say, you know, family and uh, and my mom. What about spirituality? Oh yeah, spirituality is big too. Uh, you know, when you're a kid, you more feel it than know it. But when you grow into it, it's both. You 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 feel it and you know it. How did your parents define your spirituality? By making sure that I recognized to wield it cautiously. Did you ever feel like you were get, getting off, going off the, the rails? Oh man, I've been so far off the rails, it's, it's not even, it's amazing I'm even here today. That's why talk, even standing here talking to you is a freaking gift, because it's only by the grace. And what's next for you musically? What's going on? Next for me musically is uh, touring with a, 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 one of the greatest blues legends of all time, Charlie Musselwhite. Wow. I'm getting to play, with, uh, play music with him and that's been a lifelong dream. And have you been, have you guys uh, done pre-production together, been getting ready for the road? Oh man, we've been hitting it hard. We made a record called, you know, we made a record, I don't want to, I feel like such a freaking mook when I'm plugging my own music, but we have a record called Get Up, and we've been touring behind it all year, and it's been some of the best musical experiences of my life. What, what kind of education are you getting from Charlie Musselwhite? Never play the same note in the same solo twice. How can you do that? Do you have to consciously think about what you're playing or does it come naturally? It reminds you to be, if you can be reminded to be unconscious, it reminds you to just play and be played, not play emotions, not notes. That's Charlie. What's the greatest part of being a parent? The greatest part about being a parent is seeing how proud your kids are of themselves when they accomplish something that was hard for them. I saw my youngest son go down a set of uh, five stairs the other day with a whole group of kids that weren't quite ready to do that and he stood out and, and did it and it was uh, it was one of the great experiences to see him you know overcome that that nervousness or my oldest son freaking getting an A plus in physics or my daughter on the volleyball team or my other daughter getting the lead in her play. I've got four kids so I'm proud of all four for four different reasons because they're all so different. Does the state of the world scare you? Uh, no, no, because everything has its beginning, middle, and end. So, nice. you know what I mean? I'm just hoping we're, we're at the arc of the beginning. All right. Hey, God bless you, man. Have Thank a great you. day. So much good, so great talking to you. Oh, man, you too. The Blaring Out Show.